Hello everyone, welcome to Sushma's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you a very healthy breakfast recipe that is Alu Paratha or potato stuffed uh, roti. So I hope you like this and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. First, for making the Alu Paratha, I need to uh, prepare the dough for the chapati. For the, uh, I have taken here uh, 3 to 4 cups of uh, whole wheat atta. This is whole wheat atta and we need to add 1 teaspoon of salt in this how much you were required if you want less salt you can mix it well now i'm gonna knead this with some cold water you can add cold water or if you want you can add uh, if you want to make uh, soft chapatis you can now add warm milk also you can add or uh, some mash to put bananas you can add if you want a tasty and uh, soft chapatis if you add cold water also it will become soft you have to nicely knead and we have to make it soft and uh, in this i'm going to add two to three tablespoon of oil and we need to knead this nicely for another five minutes if you knead it nicely or uh, with your hand like it will be uh, soft the chapatis will come out well so now you can see uh, it's nice and soft the dough is nice and soft and cover this with the towel or a plate if you don't have a towel you can cover this and rest it for half an hour at least half an hour you have to leave this aside for making the stuffing uh, i have taken uh, some boiled tomato potatoes and i have mashed here i have taken uh, three to four boiled potatoes i have mashed well over here and in this i'm going to add the spices salt as per required you need to add maybe a half a teaspoon is enough because you have already added in the batter so don't add too much of salt and a half a teaspoon of red chili powder and a half a teaspoon of coriander powder goes into this and a little bit of turmeric and three to four uh, chopped uh, green chilies and one big onion I've taken here cut into small pieces and some carom seeds that's ajwain I'm adding in this and we need to mix all these together Mix it nicely. You can uh, take your hand. This is always better. If you mix it with your hand, uh, all the spices will mix together nicely. Check for the salt and everything if you want. The stuffing is ready now. See, now the dough is ready. Uh, I have all the, I prefer to put it in the floor and knead it nicely. you want you can put some flour now I'm going to make this into small balls I'm making into small round balls and you have to keep make like this and keep this aside Now I'm going to take some flour and uh, make this flat, not too much, a little bit we need to make. Just press on the edges like this, you have to press on the edges 
to make it thin so you have to make this like this and now we have to add the filling i have put some coriander also in this um, potato i'm going to add some in this and cover this filling See, make this like this flat now don't press this too hard uh, just slightly roll this otherwise uh, the potato the stuffing will come out you have to roll this slightly It will be thick only don't uh, feel that uh, it is very thick it has to be a little thick then only the stuffing will don't come out otherwise uh, all the stuffing will come out okay now it's ready uh, let us make some more now i have taken a pan here to fry the parathas i'm gonna add a little bit of oil Normally, uh, the traditional way they use uh, butter for aloo parathas, but here I'm using oil. We need to fry this in a low flame, a medium flame maybe. You have to fry this in a medium flame. If you want, you can add still more oil. And let it fry for two minutes see it, has, it is turning brown in color it has to be fried nicely like this so that the taste uh, the uh, aloo and everything cooks inside well and it tastes very good now you can see this is uh, almost done the aloo paratha it's fully cooked and nice and crispy outside now this is the time we can turn off the flame and uh, we uh, otherwise we'll uh, do the rest of the parathas also. And this is how you do the alu paratha. It's very easy to make and healthy breakfast also because it contains all the uh, uh, potatoes and the whole wheat flour and everything. Hope you will like this.